every blood sugar reading, that's your content. That's how you feed your kids. That's embarrassing. Anyway, so you're pathetic for striking people, abusing the copyright system. <laughs> you came up scabba dabba doo. -doo. <laughs> yeah, seriously. Seriously. You want to talk sh about me? Cam up. It's easy. But anyway, I don't even care. Like, they're just, they're crimes. They're like a disease on the internet. Like, that's all they are. And, like, how are you going to copyright strike other people for using your content here and there, which, by the way, it's fair use, when all you do, all you do is use my content every single day? I'm not going to... People are like, you should copyright strike her. No, because I'm not an idiot like her. You know why? Because if you copyright strike somebody, I learned this a long time ago. You can't just copyright strike somebody. Like you have to take them to court. They're, YouTube is not a mediator in this instance. You have to take the person to court. You have to follow up with your own lawyer. It's so embarrassing. I can't even say it. They're taking people to court. They're suing them for copyright infringement. They're going to have to pay those legal fees because if you abuse that system, if you make false copyright claims, you're going to have to pay people's legal fees. That's all you're going to do. You're going to waste your time. You're going to waste your money and yeah, get her for a terms of service violation. Well, yeah, like I think like, I don't know exactly like what, you know, like, okay. So for example, yeah, I don't, I don't strike for copyright because it's not copy. It's not a copyright issue. Um, you know, in my opinion, having an, in my personal opinion, having an entire channel using one person's content, the full thing every day for, for no educational, no, no purpose other than to bully that person is not fair use, but try to argue that in a court of law, right? Like, no thanks. So, but to sit there and be like, I'm going to strike you, that's so embarrassing. Like these people are clowns. I don't know. But anyway, Miffy, I can be concerned about my health and have an opinion. Do I like what? 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 Are you dumb? Shouldn't they be concerned with their own life, with their own raising their kids, like their own weight loss journey? They're the two of them together are over five hundred pounds. Like, are you kidding me? Get out of here! <laughs> I love how just because I have to be focusing on my health, I have to like do that twenty four seven. Like, do you want me to start doing push ups right now or what? Like, it boggles my mind. Imagine that Scabba is crying for false copyright strike while her whole channel stealing Foodie Beauty's content with no creativity but crap like her. Exactly, she sits there and is like, you're gonna lose a foot, Chantal. By the way, I know you can't speak proper English. It's Chantal, okay? Yeah, get it right. I've been wanting to say that for a long time. You sound like deliverance. Just shut up. I'm like the center of this war world community that you've created and I don't have a right to say anything? I don't think so, buddy. I don't care if people unsub Vera. My subs are fine. I have my plaque. Good. I'm done. I don't care how many people unsub now. And by the way, I'm on a good track right now. My sugars are coming down. I'm back on my meds. I'm down 15 kgs. Thank you very much. This shirt is fitting me now. I don't know what else you want, Vera, but I don't owe you anything. Anyway, so that's all I wanted to say about that. Like